Hi guys and welcome back to The Right Take. In this video, we're going to talk about the whole controversy that Lil Nas X has been going through and we will tell you why he's getting all the hate. So keep watching until the end to know everything about it. But before we begin, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Also, don't forget to hit the bell icon. This way you'll be notified whenever we post a new video and you'll never miss on any interesting videos posted by us. With that out of the way, let's begin with the video. So recently Lil Nas X, who blew up from his song Old Town Road, has been getting a lot of hate on social media. There are a lot of memes and funny TikToks being made on him, which are all in the viral category right now, but why is it all happening? Well, let me elaborate for you. Well, recently Lil Nas X came out with a new song and the name of the song is Montero, Call Me By Your Name. The song was pretty good and it had a high amount of hype as well. Since the fan base of Lil Nas X is mostly children who started to follow him after his hit Old Town Road, it has really been waited for by them. While the audio is totally fine, the controversy arises from the official video. In the video for the song, you can see Lil Nas X going to hell while pole dancing and he's going underground. Once he makes it into hell, he finds the devil and dances with him. He twerks and seduces the devil, and at the end he ends up killing the devil and takes his powers by taking the horns. This is the point which was unappreciated by the people. People started to call out Lil Nas X for the depiction of evil in his video. According to these people, while Nas is supposed to be a children's songwriter, the whole thing done in Call Me By Your Name is objectionable, and some big people have called him out for this. According to these people, they say that they do not want their children to grow up watching such demonic activities. He's claimed to bring up Satanism, and some people are also saying that Lil Nas X has sold his soul to the demon, and now he's a member of the Illuminati. A bunch of famous people have also called out Lil Nas X on purpose, and Nas has responded to them very confidently if you ask me. Take this conversation between Nas and Joyner Lucas for example. Joyner said, I think the biggest problem for me is the fact that he doesn't understand the old town road is every kid's anthem. Children love him for that record. They tuned in and subscribed to his channel, so with no disclaimer he just dropped some left fieldish, and all our kids saw it, SMH. To this Nas tweeted back, I literally sing about lean and the doll tree in Old Town Road. You let your child listen. Blame yourself. So this is the argument that everyone else has to make, and Lil Nas X has come up with his own answers. He's being claimed to be the lawyer for Satanism in the current time, and this is why the whole controversy is created. But honestly, Lil Nas X is using the exact same strategy to get more money, Nas is using this controversy to get more attention, and as he gets more attention, he's getting more views. And as you know, more views means more money. So this controversy is nothing shy of being a very smart marketing strategy. On the other hand, he's also a gay person and we really respect that, but some people are taking their chance to take a spoof and target him based on this. They did not know about it earlier and as a result, those people who do not support LGBTQ are also targeting Lil Nas X. Tab more if you were to the fire, Lil Nas X has recently launched a limited time sneaker collection with Nike and the shoes contain real blood. This is another reason why he's getting all this hate, as he has taken the demon theme to the extremes. While people are criticizing it, a lot of people don't seem to be bothered. The reason I'm saying this is because the shoes got sold out in just one minute. Well, this shows that Nas is definitely getting a lot of traction with this controversy to say the least. Well, this is it for the video. Thank you for watching, and we'll hope to see you soon in the next one.